Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So a couple of videos ago, I posted a video on the brand called Color Science and I was talking about the loose mineral sunscreen in that video, which is right here. If you haven't already checked out that video, I will link it below for you or up above here in the iCard. But in that video, I told you that I had ordered another product from Color Science and that I hadn't received it yet. So I finally received it a week ago and I've been trying this new product out for a couple of days and I really want to share my thoughts and opinions on this product. So if you're interested in seeing what I have to say about this one, then please keep on watching. So the product that I ended up picking up is the Color Science Total Eye 3-in-1 Renewal Therapy Care in an SPF 35. So not only is this an SPF for underneath your eyes, it's also a treatment as well. So it color corrects, it also de-puffs your eyes, it's supposed to help with fine lines and wrinkles, and it brightens like a dream as well. So you can use this alone by itself and that's it, or if you're some with more discoloration, or you have dark under eye circles, or you just want more coverage underneath your eyes, then you can go in with your under eye concealer on top of this product. So as you can see in this video here, it does have a flat applicator and you can see where the product comes out. And I really love this applicator a lot. It really does depuff when you do put it underneath your eyes. It's a nice cooling effect and I really love that feeling, especially in the morning because you just feel more refreshed and your under eyes just feel really good when you apply it underneath your eyes like this. So this product also helps with brightness. Like I said, it's 100% mineral sunscreen, so it's chemical free, which I really love. And I've been trying to find a product like this where I can put it underneath my eyes and have an SPF. Of course, you can use your regular SPF and put it right underneath your eyes, which I do, but I wanted something extra to put underneath my under eyes, and this is going to be it. So I'm gonna demo it for you in just a minute, but I do want to tell you a little bit more about the product before I get there. So this product here, you're getting 0.23 fluid ounces, which is seven mils of product. Lots of peptides in it, as well as hyaluronic acid. There's a lot of great ingredients packed in to this product right here, and it really does treat your under eyes, and it really does de-puff your under eyes. It's supposed to help with fine lines and wrinkles, and it's also supposed to help those dark circles as well. And and you're also getting one shade as well. So in a minute, you're gonna see the color of it. It is a peachy tone, and it really does brighten and covers dark circles like a dream. So if you're somebody with really dark circles, you're definitely gonna to wanna to invest in this product. Not only is it a treatment, but it's gonna really cover your under eye circles as well, and preps your under eyes for your concealer. It's great underneath makeup. It's a great makeup base, and I really love that because your concealer just sticks to it and it doesn't move it's so so good and then you're knowing that you have extra protection underneath your concealer and it's also treating your under eyes as well you can use this every single day you can use it in the morning as well as nighttime of course it's more beneficial to use in the morning as it color corrects and there's an SPF in there but it's your choice you can do whatever you'd like this is also really hydrating as well which I really like but it's not greasy and when you put it under your eyes and you let it sit for a few minutes before you go in and put your under eye concealer on it just makes your under eyes so nice and hydrated and it just feels so good underneath your skin and of course you can set it with powder afterwards if you'd like as well you can do that also and that's what I'm going to show you in my demo so I don't have any under eye concealer on right now all I have is obviously a full face of makeup but underneath my eyes I just have what I did for my skincare this morning as well as my face SPF which I brought underneath my eyes and then I put all of my makeup on on top but I left my under eyes out so that I I can demo this for you and as you can see my under eyes look a little shiny they look a little bit discolored and you're gonna see how well this product works when I put this on and then I go in with my concealer afterwards it looks so nice and smooth and it's it's so good you're just gonna have to see it so let's get to it okay so I've just zoomed in here so that you can see the true color of it and how it applies so you want to make sure that you press down on this little button here which dispenses the product which I've just pressed down on and then as you can see this is what it looks like it does have a nice peachy hue to it which is going to help with that brightening and to help cover the discoloration or dark circles that you may have and you can see with the color that 
you could use it alone if you really wanted to, depending on how much coverage you're looking for. So I'm going to show you how I do it here. So I'm just going to take a little bit of that product off a little bit because there is a bit, there is kind of too much on there. So I've just put a little bit on the back of my hand, but I'm going to apply it with this. And you just want to dab on where you want it. So I like to do at least four little dots like that. You can do more afterwards if you'd like, but I would start off minimal and then gradually work your way up if you need it. And then if you want, you can do this to get that nice cooling effect, which really is nice. I love how nice and cool it is and it definitely depuffs when you look really tired in the morning. It really does help with that. And you could just do this and then walk out the door, but when you look up closely, you can tell that you still need to blend that in with your finger or with a brush or sponge. So what I like to do is, once I do that, I then like to dab it in and pat it in with my ring finger and go from there. And as you can see, it's very minimal. I didn't put a lot on, but if you're somebody that doesn't need a lot of coverage, then this is all you need. And it really does glide on so nicely. It's so hydrating. But for this video, I'm gonna do a little bit more just to show you. So what I put on the back of my hand, I'm gonna grab from that now just to use up some of that product. And then I'm going to dab on a little bit more. You can as well put this on your eyelids and you can put it above underneath your brow bone as well. I did that once and I think I put too much product and my eyes started to kind of burn, like my eyes were watering. So I think I just put on way too much that day. So I definitely don't put it on my eyelids, but I do put it underneath here sometimes, but in this video I didn't. This is just strictly underneath my eyes just to show you. But if you do it up here, it will treat that area as well, as well as protect it from the sun also. So now that I've put more on, I'm going to dab my finger again and to blend it all around. And then I like to switch my fingers sometimes to have a clean finger and then dab it in so that I don't have a lot of product. I'm massaging this in and dabbing this in nice and evenly. And I like to do this a lot because the finger that you start off with has the most product. So if I find I have too much product underneath my eyes, I like to then switch my fingers and just blend it in a little bit better. Okay, so I don't know if you can see the difference here. You can see that this is more color corrected. It's a lot more even, it looks more natural. This side here still looks a little bit more shiny and a little bit more discolored. So once I do my concealer, you're gonna see a really big difference. So let me get my concealer. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in with the concealer. I still haven't touched this eye here. I've left that alone. I'm gonna work on this eye from start to finish and then I'm gonna show you the before and after of what your under eyes can look like. So I'm gonna go in with the Lancome Long Lasting Under Eye Concealer right here. I really love this. It really is long lasting. It doesn't crease and it's not cakey either. It's really hydrating. So I'm gonna go in with just a little bit on my finger here because I don't need a lot and I'm gonna do the same technique where I'm just going to dab and blend in with my finger and I really do like to use my finger because your finger is warm and I just find that it blends everything in really nicely okay so just like that so as you can see I didn't need a lot but this is just like an extra coverage on top and I like to go a little bit lighter with my concealer so that I can have my under eyes nice and bright. But as you can see here, that is the side with the color science and under eye concealer. And this is the side with nothing else on it. So you do see a pretty big difference here. And I love the outcome. So now I'm going to set it and show you what I do in that step. So now I'm going to be setting my under eye with some setting powder and the one that I'm going to be using is the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Finish Setting Powder in the color Fair. I always like to go lighter with setting powders because I like to keep my under eyes nice and bright and refreshed. So this is Fair but it acts as a translucent powder. So I'm going to take a little brush like this and I'm going to put a little bit on my brush like that and then I'm going to apply it under my eyes in dabbing motions like this. 
I don't like to go all crazy underneath my eyes because I feel like you're moving all of the products around and then it just doesn't look very good. So I like to do light dabbing motions like this and I find it works the best that way for setting. And if you haven't seen my video on how to prevent under eye creasing with your concealer, definitely check it out. I'll link it below for you. It's with this setting powder and it's just so, so good. So you're gonna have to definitely check that out if you're interested. So there we go. So as you can see, it's nicely set. I have no discoloration going on. It looks nice and smooth and it looks natural. I just really love that look. And then as you can see in my before, it looks really shiny. It looks discolored. I look tired and you can just see a major difference here. And I just love the outcome that this technique gives me. That color science really does top it all off and it really does prep your under eyes and it just it just gives a nice overall look once you've added that extra product underneath your concealer. It really does help and it's like you're getting a double whammy with color, but you're also getting the nice treatment underneath to protect your under eyes from the sun as well as it's helping with fine lines and wrinkles. There's hyaluronic acid in there for hydration and it's just so, so good. So now I'm going to finish off my other eye and I'll be right back. Okay, so I've done the other eye and this is the outcome with both eyes done with the color science, with the concealer, as well as the setting powder. And I just really love the overall look. I look really refreshed, I don't look tired, and my under eyes are concealed and I have no discoloration going on. So I really love the outcome and I just think it looks really good. What do you think? Let me know below because I would love to know what you have to say about this outcome as well. So I really hope that you loved today's video. I really hope that I introduced you to a product that could help you out with your dark circles, with your fine lines and wrinkles, as well as an extra step that maybe you were missing to get that extra coverage that you have always been looking for. I'm not somebody with a lot of discoloration, as you could just see there, but I do have a lot of pink and purple tones going on as well and I do find sometimes it's really hard to conceal underneath my eyes where I don't look tired that I look really refreshed and I have found that this product has really made my under eyes look more awake I look so refreshed and it's also treating my under eyes as well for the fine lines that I do have and it's also protecting it with an SPF 35 as well with for UVA and for UVB protection. So I really love this product. I would highly, highly recommend this product to anybody. I actually have my mom using this product as well and she's been using it and loving it as well. And she has nothing but good things to say about the product. So I got my mom into it and I'm hoping that I can maybe get you into it as well. I will have everything linked for you below so that it's easy for you to click on and take you right to the page where you can read a little bit more about it and educate yourself a little bit more if you'd like and I just think this is a genius product and I think Color Science is a very good brand. I love that they're all mineral based, they're very gentle on the skin, it's good for sensitive skin people and I just I just absolutely love them. So I really hope that you found today's video helpful and that you did like it. If you did, of course, could you please give it a thumbs up? That always helps me know what videos you like the best. And if you can also subscribe below as well, that would be great. Don't forget to click that notification bell so that you never miss any of my future videos. So I will definitely see you in my next video. Take care and we'll see you then. Bye.